Research is very important to our college because it helps our medical students and residents to engage in critical thinking, problem solving, and scientific method. So innovation is all about this, this boundary between typical medical research and rapid advancements in technology. And here we have to have both the innovators who have the expertise technically and the clinical personnel who know how to take care of patients and put them together to make something that's truly exceptional for our patients. So the Jump Center is not only one of the top seven uh, simulation centers in the world based on its size. It is the eminent simulation center which is fully integrated into an innovation process. And there is no innovation center of this type in the world that has such tremendous philanthropic funding making it available so that students and faculty can work on projects to improve healthcare outcomes. Innovation in medicine is challenging in particular because medical research is very time consuming as it should be to protect the people that we care about you know, in healthcare. At the same time, there's such a need for us to be able to spur our care forward at a timely fashion. But the design of JUMP is also so that you can inspect that work and not just work on education or training, but actually design and build new solutions that make work safer and more efficient. And this leads to better patient outcomes by a multiplier effect. The ability to look out at the horizon and pick anything as, you know, as my go-to strategy for the day, it's really, really fulfilling. Physicians and healthcare providers, they rely often on this uh, latest research findings to make clinical decisions to ensure their patients are safe and effective. The technique is to be able to observe how care is delivered in simulated environments, to improve upon that care by affecting behavior change among the clinicians. So these are medical students and residents who work with nurses and people in the hospital to affect those great care outcomes. The infrastructure provides a lot of support to the faculty to start their research and generate data and go for publications and grant funding. However, to do a lot of advanced techniques, we still need to expand our facilities. Because of the opportunity to work with philanthropy, uh, both philanthropy at the university and both philanthropy here at OSF, students can engage in project teams that build new intellectual property. They can actually become part of solutions of the future by participating in these projects. For me, it's being able to explore new worlds. I can come into the lab and I can decide for myself, what am I going to do today? What problem do I want to solve? It's my curiosity uh, for the experiments I'm doing and the outcome of those experiments that drives me every day. Peoria is proud to host the College of Medicine in our city. The vision of your founders and the community leaders who brought the College of Medicine here has been fully realized.